Earlier this week, we told you about a Spring Lake woman who was forced to walk more than an hour to work every day after losing her car following a crash in which she was not at fault. After our story aired, many people reached out to help, including a man who said he was inspired to change her life. 13 on your side, Keely Lovern met with a woman again today and joins us now with details on what turned out to be an emotional surprise, Keely. Yeah, emotional to say the least, Juliet. And without the support of the community and sharing her story, none of this would have been possible. And I can't wait to share this update with all of you. Let's take a look. Samantha Turcott has been walking an hour and a half to work every day after an accident left her without a car in early February. Yeah. Just days after sharing her story. Oh my God. <laughs> her situation looks much different. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Samantha says so many people reached out to help offering their support. I don't expect anything from people. And even rides to work. I just kept trying to stay strong, knowing that there are good people out there. Samantha says she never wanted to ask for money or charity, but instead just share her experience in hopes of inspiring others. When I saw her with those two kids and I saw her smile, I said, this is a woman who is really living the role and she loves her children. Within hours of seeing her story, an anonymous donor came to the WZZM news station. So to me, it says, I gotta do something about this. The gentleman asked us to give Samantha a check for $10,000. She opened it on Wednesday morning. Samantha couldn't believe it. No, no. Samantha. Oh my God. I know it's been a trauma for you. <laughs> And although he didn't want to be involved, the man had this message for her. I want you to know there are people out there in the world who hold you very sacred. Jesus loves you. God made us all to love one another. You deserve it. <laughs> you really do. Not knowing you, but I still love you. I actually just had someone uh, from a dealership get a hold of me and said that if I could come up with so much, they'd have a vehicle for me. She couldn't do that an hour and a half if she didn't have the love in her heart for those two kids. And, <gasps> and what I could do to help Samantha and her children. With a car, Samantha can again see her son and hopefully make it to her daughter's upcoming choir concert. I feel like my insides are jumping. <laughs> my goal in life every day is to bring a smile to somebody's face. This wonderful person, thank you. This means so much. And Samantha says she is so grateful for everyone who has reached out to help, even if they couldn't donate monetarily, but just showing her love and support. And she also says she'll send me an update when she gets her new car.